okay this video I'll be demonstrating what are the open source uh, testing tools available in the market uh, which has been used successfully implemented in the companies and projects okay so agenda would be uh, what are the business challenges we are facing today in the software testing world and I'll be talking some overview challenges uh, in the software companies with respect to software testing comparison between open source and commercial tools and with respect to the software testing life cycle what are the tools and technologies can be used open source frameworks which are available and with respect to the cloud okay today's uh, business market requires a uh, faster uh, achievement and significant expenditures in testing tools okay so uh, we need to organize and uh, we need to do a uh, task very quickly and very effectively with respect to the quality okay so organizations are uh, very much under pressure to reduce the cost so cost cuttings are happening okay so we need to uh, adapt ourselves not only use the commercial tools but we need to use the open source tools also whenever it is required to reduce a task okay so again you can see what are the challenges we are facing today's uh, market actually okay so uh, many cost cuttings are happening with respect to the tools and with respect to the employees and with respect to the resources so we need to understand and we need to use uh, these open source tools wherever it is required so with respect to the open source tools there are many open source tools are available at the net okay so just we need to experience and guidance uh, to download those tools and use at the proper time and proper reason okay these tools are open source and completely free of license and which has some source distributions okay we can customize it uh, as and when it's, it is required so uh, let's see an overview of an open source tools with different types of testing which is available okay with respect to the functional automation with respect to the accepting testing continuous integration defect management and stress management performance testing okay there are many tools are available you can see the chart like what are the tools are our tools and our tools and techniques are available okay so that we can use so when we do a comparison between a commercial tools and open source tools let's talk about the commercial tools commercial tools are developed just to make a make make our life more easy okay so that's why uh, commercial tools are very expensive and will be paid uh, okay so by the companies okay so commercial tools have 24 bar 7 support definitely and uh, there will be a return or uh, return of investment ROI so when you plan to go for a commercial use your project needs to be very long term you cannot do an ROI calculation for a short term project if you are using a commercial tool and it's easy to uh, recruit the staff or staff also because it's easy to learn and some dedicated trainers will be there and there will be less coding all the features will be built in just need to drag and drop those features and start using the tools with respect to the open source okay definitely you need some experience and expertise to use the open source tools okay so uh, these are a flexible easy of procurement easy of usage tool customization can be done as I said source distributions will be there you just need to download the source code also of the of these tools and you can customize as per your projects and there is no support so you need to find out the answer using open source communities and forums okay so definitely use of open source tools need some expertise a programming expertise to use this okay you need to be a programmer either java or ruby or some other programming to use these open source tools Okay, with respect to the software testing life cycle, we have certain phases like requirement analysis, test planning, test case development, test script development and the execution of different types of testings. Okay, for these type of uh, different phases, you, need, you can use different types of open source tools. So with respect to the test management, we have test link which is already people are using it and which is very proven. Testopia is one of the uh, test management tool uh, with the uh, um, Mozilla from Mozilla okay then we have xstudio xstudio is uh, mainly built, built for agile you can use for agile development and testing okay 
with respect to the defect tracking tools we have jira bugzilla and mantis okay jira and bugzilla are world widely used and which are proven and people are using it so with respect to the automation tools there are many open source tools are available hundreds and thousands of tools are available in the market uh, now what are the phases you automate like you automate using smoke testing regression testing and to end testing and integration testing so these tools can be used in these type of testing uh, types okay so what are the famous tools of course selenium is one of the widely used tools okay so that's why uh, selenium when you read with respect to the selenium uh, it's completely a browser based testing okay so you can uh, browser compatibility different types of browsers you can use and battery is also a very uh, widely used tool for automation testing sahi is um, something like a partial automation partially it has open source version and professional version now sequly is a very nice tool for image based automation okay so these are the websites you can just log in and uh, download and do a trial on these type of tools now auto it is one of one, one, one simple tool where you can create an exe file script just like a vb script uh, you can run the process and it helps certain browser based uh, uh, objects which are in windows based uh, pop ups can be automated and some java script java based uh, pop ups can be automated using auto it a user friendly tool and very effective with respect to automation and some of the uh, mobile automation tools uh, robot is robotium is a very proven tool and uh, which is used for uh, android automation and selenium web driver we have a android driver to execute the selenium test on the android browser and monkey talkie can be used for both android and ios so you can download these bindings from these websites okay so performance testing one of the uh, main area which affects the business directly okay so we need to be more seriously uh, concentrating on performance testing now what are the tools available so there are many tools are available in the market but very effectively very proven uh, used tool is jmeter actually so jmeter we have wide range of plugins uh, which can be integrated and can be used so this is the where we can achieve different types of performance testing from this tool okay so another important aspect is web services testing so of course jmeter is also can be used for web services testing but there is another tool for web service testing that is soapi which is widely used this is a one version has a open source another version has a paid version so open source version we can achieve a lot actually and we can integrate to different environments like java environment we can integrate it and run the soapio test and from java environment and it has a support for groovy scripting also so when it comes to open source frameworks we have certain bdd level frameworks and keyword driven frameworks which is already available for test automation okay we are already some built in features are there we can make use of we make use of this and we can build our automation frameworks okay cucumber is j behave is built on bdd framework and fitness and robot frameworks are used they are built on keyword driven frameworks now it is, comes to the continuous integration continuous integration is one of the major activities that is done today in the today's world so there are two open source tools which is widely used that is jenkins and cruise control yeah, and which are proven and which are very effective lot of plugins are there for jenkins you can integrate to different tools and technologies and we can achieve the continuation integration process very effectively now another thing is going on in the market is the cloud based tools like what are the cloud testing tools are available for automation performance and mobile test automation things so there are some many tools are available but nothing is open source partially it is open source okay there are two tools are available which is partially open source that is sosta and source labs okay sosta is something like uh, automation testing is uh, partially open source sosta has two products that is cloud test light and touch test uh, which is a open source products and which can be used for uh, test automation freely and performance testing uh, some 20 users are uh, allowed apart from that you need to pay as per the usage of the virtual users source lab is also similar it's based upon test automation selenium as a background okay so you can use a uh, certain time bounding is there within the time you can use it as a open source okay 
okay these references are taken from open source testing.org log into the website to see more and more uh, open source available thank you